Ah, let's get back to Death Stranding. Let's see where I left off. Oh, right. Death. And I'm stranded. Okay, well, um, so I guess this is... Oh, I probably shouldn't hang around here for too long, huh? Um, but what I was gonna... S Jesus. I can hear them, like, all around me. It's actually kind of freaky. Um, what was I gonna say? I guess, uh, now that I have a baby, uh, suckling on my sweet pee, I'm assuming that's definitely, like, pee, which means that my baby is basically a kidney. Now that I have a baby kidney going for me, I assume that that lets me see these evil things in a much clearer, uh, light than beforehand. I forget if I can, uh, crouch in this game or not. Well, that's... I can... Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I can grab onto my straps. And then I can jump. And then I can rest, but I don't think it's allowing me to do such an act. Uh... Alright. Okay, that was sprint. That's the opposite of crouching. So... Yeah. I'm just... Okay. I think this is definitely cautioning me to not go in the direction that I'm currently going in. Uh, there's also... I... I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now, but this guy, he's definitely wanting to grope some ghosts. Uh... Oh! Okay. So... Oh, okay. Okay. Now I understand what the point of the, uh... What the breath-holding mechanic is. When near a butt tiger, hold your breath. Holding your breath will make it harder for the butt tigers to detect you when you're moving. Be careful when your endurance gauge is depleted. Sam will be forced to take a deep breath. No, he was uh, he was just dying last time. He didn't. He wasn't forced to take no deep breath. Okay, so I think if I just head off in this direction, there's not going to be any butt tigers here, except for that one. And I think, uh oh, yeah, okay, uh, alright, we gotta be like Tay-Tay and we gotta shake it off. Okay, do I hold the space, or not space, do I hold the triangle button, or do I, uh, like tap it over and over again? Um, okay, we're gonna, let's see, I think if I just get over here, then... These guys will leave me alone. And they did. Oh, wow. What's the sound of one tar pit having a thousand orgasms at the same time? It's apparently... Oh! Alrighty, so I think all the butt tigers are uh, distracted off and behind me. Except for those that have now figured out where I am. So, I'm going to assume that if I just, uh, okay, I'm, all right, 0 for 2 on sneaking past the butt tigers. You know, I could definitely be working on improving my ratio here. Uh, my stamina is going to deplete too, so I definitely have that working for me. Uh, okay, we're going to grip for balance, and my endurance meter is gone, so I'm going to just start dying, aren't I? Yep. Okay. All right. Uh, I have now been converted into the ocean, and that's a shark, and I think I can probably just sprint away from that. All I need to do is get onto land, right? And there's plenty over there. The, the weird shark thing can't possibly catch up to me now. There we go. See, there's no danger. Uh... Oh, shit, there's the danger. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Here we go. If I go over here, he's not going to know where I am. There we go. I... I made it. And just immediately ate shit down a mountain. <laughs> 
Okay, so my baby is no longer safely enveloped in urine. It's now in peach juice. Um, okay, and then I guess I also need to refill my canteen. I'm not entirely sure what happened, but I'm just going to chill out here for a second and then let my baby... Uh, well... Okay, I guess I'll select my canteen and give myself a little sippy of monster energy drink. Ah, stupid, stupid. God, I hate that that's a mechanic in this game. All righty, well, we'll drink some monster and uh, my baby's gonna just be a little bit freaked out for a little while, but you know what? He can deal with it. And yeah, there he goes, there he goes. He's now, he's now covered in oil as opposed to pee or mango juice, so I think that, that means that he's in little baby heaven now. Alrighty, where the hell am I? Okay, I guess I want to be heading back towards this one, or this area. So we'll go ahead and head towards whatever that one was. Alright, yeah, that all looks convincing. Just gotta have to head back to uh, where the butt tigers and the cuttlefish of death were. And this time, I'll know what to do. Which is hope that they're gone, and I think that they are because I plotted them away. Yep. And to think. I wonder if that happens every time anybody incinerates their mom. I wonder. If somebody incinerated your mom, would the entire world be engulfed in flame? The answer is probably. There's a lot of dead fish. Well, uh, you know, there's a famous guy who was once able to make fish out of nothing, but I'm not sure if he was a cuttlefish or not. All right, well, yeah, I think that I've managed to uh, trip across the finish line of that little uh, plot segment. And I think that now I should be able to just freely head on back to my base. And what the hell is that? Can I pick it up? Oh, I can't collect that. It's a crystal? I... I somehow doubt that's a crystal, and if it is a crystal, then it's probably haunted. Um, I think that I would like to avoid anything that's shaped vaguely skeletal and hand-like, because I think that that's like the Pringles of hands, and that once it grabs something, it can't stop. It would be like an infinite masturbation curse. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can go up to people and be like, like, ha ha, I've evolved past the need for such um, primitive things such as like dating and, and, um, and, and sexual intercourse because I have my auto jacker. I would be heralded as a hero of all time if I invented the auto jacker course it's just a you just take you just do it with a shake weight anyway uh did i happen to run by, by some water bears there they are delicious delicious oh i need to hold it down there we go delicious del Ugh, it's disgusting. disgusting disgusting water bears why did i go into bullet time for eating a eating one of those things. Do they also run away from me whenever I try to eat them? Because if so, cowards. Also, is my stamina meter like slightly off from one hundo? It's probably because I'm missing some blood. That was probably also explained to me in a tutorial, but eh. This game's a hell of a lot easier when you don't have to carry anything, huh? In fact, I guess if you don't have to carry anything at all, you can basically sprint infinitely. Because the game doesn't seem to be slowing me down at all. He's got pretty good running technique, I think. I only count the fact that I... Well... Uh, uh, oh, okay. 
Uh, L1 plus down plus square. All right. Baby. Uh, okay. Am I supposed to, like, hold square? Hang on. All right. So I press square, and then... Uh, okay, this is how I look around. Uh, oh, okay, so I shake it. I shake my... Do I shake my controller? Is that how it works? Okay. L1, down. Uh, hold square, and then shake the baby. Shake it. Shake it until it becomes P. Don't... No, we're not done shaking the baby. All right. You will become P. And then you'll become oil, which is like concentrated pee. Come on. Don't you want to? Great. Now the baby's quiet. Uh, the baby's cries woke up Novato music, and now we have to listen to Poznan from their album Low Roar, apparently. contribution from chat. You can pee on where the water bears are to speed up their respawn. Um, is peeing a mechanic in this game? Because if so, I was not prepared for that. If I pee on a wolf, do I get the ability to, like, pretend that I'm a wolf? I'm asking for a furry friend of mine. Just, just throwing that out there. We Wait, I can double jump? No. I can double jump in this game? There's no way. Okay, jump. I can double jump. Oh, I can also take a bath in the water here. Uh, okay. So not only can this guy come back to the from the dead, he can also miraculously jump twice in the air. <laughs> like I'm supposed to believe that. Thinking in the future there'll be something like a jet pack. Stupid. Hang on. Uh oh. Well, this is gonna end poorly. Alright. Um Okay, so I can paddle to the right. Alright, well I learned something. I learned that uh that is a mechanic in this game. And I don't think my baby very much appreciated me drowning. Oh, I get it. It's a meta... When you're carrying this baby light around with you and it's all umbilicalized, it's a metaphor for being a dude. Seahorse. Anyway, um, I wonder, okay, so apparently I can only double jump when I'm not carrying anything. If I'm carrying negative things, can I triple jump? Identifying the ID, whoa, hold on, I think that's enough certification there. You want to pre-identify the, the ID before you just jump into identifying the ID? Maybe a preliminary pre-ID scan. Come back to the distribution center. Check the location on your compass. I'm sure it's right there, but I could also be wrong. Let's see. Uh, okay, so that's Capital Not City. That's um. Well, it's either here or it's not. So we're gonna head on into um this thing. So if my last name is Bridges. Does that mean, and my mom was the president, does that mean the director is my dad? Or does that mean that, like, like, I don't know. Usually kids with a trust fund like this don't have to work nearly that hard. Death Stranding. It's a miracle either of you made it back. When someone with Doom hooks up to a BB, your feelings and memories cause feedback, like with the speaker. It amplifies fears and stress and runs the risk of taking you to a place from which you will not return. I'm sorry, but this BB has been pushed beyond its limits. This puzzle is the only option. Sam, get cleaned up and 
come to the president's office. We need to talk. Why does he have so much sentimental value with that BB? Wait, what? gonna hook itself back into itself oh oh don't worry it's okay i'll always be with you is that like a younger sam or is like sam the bb see the sunset the day is ending let that yawn Was the baby singing that? Just hear the baby doing like a boo boo boo. Thank you, Sam Bridges, for saving me from the BTs. Don't listen to Guillermo del Toro. He hates babies confirmed. Huh. He wants to destroy that baby and America is dead. Then I guess they were right. Abortion did bring <laughs> never mind. Oh god, I should have not should have kept that thought in. Uh anyway. Um alrighty. Additional likes. I got forty likes for delivering a corpse? That's what I'm talking about. I don't even get 40 likes on making a YouTube video about delivering a corpse. I just need to start doing it in real life, apparently. Where would I even find a corpse, though? I guess I could probably start with a morgue, but that seems pretty Sam, boring. I thought I told you dooms and BBs were a dangerous combination. Huh, perhaps a shower is in order. You're still covered in chiralium. Don't want the president to see you like that. The hell are you talking about? She's dead. You're upset. Is this about BB-28? Go fuck yourself. I'm not your errand boy. Well, in any event, it seems it owes you its life. No, we owe the kid our lives. You too. As you say, I shall look after it. Are you Take sure you don't want president. another baby? This is 28, implying that we have 1 through 27 just sitting around. You know, you were once a BP. We were all BP. That guy's legitimately fucking insane. Yeah, that's what every dad feels like when they have a child. Just feel like passing out. It's almost time to go, Sam. It's a dream catcher. Wear it when you sleep, and I'll keep the nightmares away. I'll always be with you. If it kept the nightmares away, how come it's not a baby? Or, uh, sorry, a BB that's hooked up to you. I suppose that's not really keeping the nightmares away so much as hooking them into your body. Wait, wasn't this guy wearing clothes when he fell asleep? Morning, Who undressed him? It's probably that fucking Guillermo del Toro fellow again. Alright. Uh, looks like I have a couple different outfits that I can unlock. I can be uh, Deadpool. I can be... Um, I can't figure out how to get up. Which button do I press to stand? It's not that one. It's not. 
Okay, we'll examine the figurines. Whoa, Jesus. I wasn't not... No, thank you. What the fuck, man? Oh, I remember those figurines. Those two guys died. They've been immortalized as shitty green army men. All right. Uh, let's... Why does he look straight at the camera like that? I just And then points at them? Why? Why would you ever do that? That is not cool in the slightest. I'm playing a video game. I don't want to feel like I'm in the video game. If I wanted that, I'd play Half-Life Alex Revenge or whatever it's called. What the fuck? Why would you ever need a mirror that turns off? It's like, oh, my mirror has privacy mode. Okay, I can perform an action. Why is this in this game? You know somebody, sp you know like three people, they spent like four months of their lives on programming just this segment and like doing all the animations for it and stuff like that. And I mean, I could take a selfie in the mirror. All right. <laughs> this would only be better if while he did that you could see like the fucking baby like climbing out of his esophagus again oh joy okay i take it back this mechanic's awesome <laughs> okay okay all right oh i take it back Boy, do I take it back. <laughs>